Hello everybody, welcome to the first video in our new cycling series. The first route we'll share with you is a 30k ride that takes you from Benidorm to Finistrad and back. Depending on your fitness levels and commitment, it should take around 2 to 3 hours, excluding the time you spend in Finistrad itself. The difficult rating should be taken with a grain of salt, but as elevation hills to ground shows, it's a hilly route. In this video, we want to give you a taste of what to expect of this ride and facilitate navigation once you're on your way. Our starting point is the Instituto Mediterraneo School, which is a secondary school in Poniente. Um, normally, uh, where you see here is a roundabout, and usually it's a dead end, but it's not because it's meant for cars, but it's not for bikes, and that's going to lead you to this gravel path where you can, you're mostly going to get lost. Uh, but yeah, remember to just follow left on the fork and then right afterwards. After a few forks, you end up on a straight along the tracks with Benidorm to your right and Puig Campana to your left. After one kilometer, you approach Polideportivo, which is basically a complex of various sports facilities such as swimming pool, athletics, indoor hall, football, basketball, tennis courts, you name it. And this is also where Love Festival takes place. As you reach join Asphalt Road, you pass a large parking on your left which is where Mercadillo takes place every Wednesday. It's mostly cheap clothes and household items, but there's plenty of stalls with vegetables and nice bread and pastries at the top. To cross strong tracks, we join a main road, which has a bike path in the middle, as is often the case in Benito. Now comes a very pleasant stretch along a mix of quiet roads and picturesque gravel. A tunnel takes you to the other side of National 332 Road and you want to turn left immediately afterwards, as continuing straight leads to a dead end. Yet another tunnel, this time under AP7, concludes this gravel section and now comes a hilly bit on a sort of service road. Way, you enter a hotel and theme park zone. On your left, there's a golf course belonging to a Melia Villaitana resort, designed to resemble a Mediterranean village. You will also see attractions of Terra Mitica on your left in the distance and pass a zoo called Terra Natura on the right. of theme park zone, you turn left on a big roundabout to join CV758. This is a main road, but it shouldn't be too busy, especially in off-season. And we recommend doing this right in the off-season, as summer temperatures may make it rather unpleasant. In any case, drivers around here are used to cyclists and leave plenty of space. think you'll find yourself in the village of Finestra. It's a hidden gem, an authentic Spanish pueblo with a rich history, built on top of a limestone cliff with Puig Campana towering over it. Archaeologists claim modern humans have inhabited this location for 20-30,000 years. That's debatable, but what is known is that Iberian tribes settled in the area around 6th century before Christ, followed by Greeks, Romans, Arabs, and Reconquista! Finestrad, as we see it today, dates back to 13th century, with the historic center built on top of ruins of a Moorish castle. History aside, have a stroll around this charming pueblo, have a caña and tapas in a local bar. 
for now, enjoy the shots from Finistrat and get your bike ready!